And here's the tale of the tape, boss. What can you say about marvelous Melvin Manu? He won his last five fights all by knockout and all in the first round. Now his opponent, Jira Musashi, has knockouts and submissions on his resume. We talked about it. Use your submission skills, trust me. Don't go to the ground. Oh, don't stay on your feet with Manhoof. This is such a Dutch intro. Whoop, whoop. Well, they're going Dutch. <laughs> Manhoof, of course, from Amsterdam. Musasi, born in Armenia. Grew up in Holland, fights out of there. Double Dutch. Whoop. In the blue corner, from the Netherlands, get up, You see the hot streak of Musasi, nine straight. That's a good streak. Musasi surprised some, defeating Dennis King in Dream 2 to advance in this tournament. The beautiful triangle choke. It'd be great if he had a microphone there. Ah, yeah, you'd like to hear what's going on, mm -hmm. wouldn't you? Okay, let's take a look now at the attributes here of Musasi. Wow, he's got speed, he's got strength, he's got stamina. That's that's all a good number. Five, five is the highest, but, but look, these numbers are higher, but then his grappling and submissions is down. 
You know, and I said it in the opening. And Musashi needs it on the ground. No secrets here. And he's got the great striking skills to set the takedown up. And we look at Matt Hoof just to our left here. As he walks off the stage, he gets ready to make his entrance. <laughs> and yeah, I think probably a one so far from what people have seen would be about right on his ground skills on a scale of five, maybe a one or a two. A one or a two, but you know what he's good at? You know, on the ground, he's very hard to keep on the ground. He's, he's very quick. Mistakes. He's so explosive. Look at this, a monster. And Manhoof has made this kind of interest before. Take the collar off, unleash him, here he comes. He defeated Kim and pulverized Sakuraba in Dream 4 to make it to the semifinals. The first of our semifinals getting ready to begin. Nick Kalikas, who sets the odds for us, betonfighting.com. He has, and this one, Musasi, a slight favorite, minus 155. Jacare is the favorite to win the middleweight tournament. Then Musasi and Manhoof are considered right behind him. Hmm. But actually a long way behind him. Jacare is a pretty solid favorite to win it all. How about this fight? Here we go. You look at the explosive man hoof and there's yeah. Musashi and it's underway. Don't blink, people. Kick early from Musashi. You ready for the counter there, man hoof is. You see the size disadvantage for man hoof, but that's not surprising for him. Shooting is in Musashi and sprawling out man hoof. Good. Oh, oh Musashi stays it. with it. Nice there, Wizard. Can he keep it up? Can he keep it up? Yes. It looks like he can keep it on the on the feet. Yes. It's there Whoa. for a moment. But Musashi yeah. is relentless and gets it back to the ground. Yep. Very armbar. Ooh. Yeah. This now is Musashi. His ground game is just better. He wants to put on that body triangle there. And while he's doing everything, he's just pushing, punching away. He's got the back. Now Manu spins forward and in mount position is Musasi. But look at the uh, quickness oh, of Manu. Look at this triangle choke attempt coming up here. Musasi really again. This is at the end of the fight. Is this could be the end. He's got to slam him as hard as he can. Look at the power of Manu. He should stay there. No, slam him down. Don't slam him down. It's, that's dangerous. That's dangerous. He shouldn't have done that. He did as Musashi yeah, tries to put over. it in. He shouldn't have done that. He should have kept him there. And he I'm does. Whoa. Musashi yep. in a first round submission victory. Hey, he was doing good on top. He was doing good on top. Just stand there. Wait till the referee breaks you up. A minute 28 into this fight, Musashi puts it away. Wow. Yep. We all knew it. We know the weakness. We knew the weaknesses from Manu. Walk straight into it. Here we go again. Look. And as you warned right here about Manu. But look here. He's got so much power, he lifts him up. And if he could have kept it here, simply keep standing there. You said don't slam him. Don't slam him because you're going to fall straight into it. Musashi's not going to let him go. Trust me on that one. His foot is locked behind his knee, so nothing is going to slip off. You see, he made sure while he fell down. Yep, now he locks it up again, and now it's just push it, pulling the head and pushing your hips forward. And that's it. Bye, arteries. They're closing up. It's over. Lights out.
Gerard Musasi winning for the 23rd time, his eighth by way of submission. He has now won 10 in a row, and he is going on to the championship of Dream 6 Middleweight Grand Prix Tournament. Plus, he's going fresh. No injuries. Nothing. Fresh and a very short work night for yep. him so far. That's, that's the major thing here. Musasi moving on. He will take on the winner of the heavily favored Jack Array against Galasic.